Ever wondered how to make an authentic pizza at home? Well, you're in the right place. Pizza is more than just a culinary delight. It's a symbol of unity, a shared experience, a slice of history. Originating from the beautiful country of Italy, this dish has crossed oceans and transcended cultures to become a universal favorite. Today we'll embark on a flavorful journey exploring the art of pizza making, so, ready your aprons and let your taste buds tingle with anticipation. Stick around to discover how to bring Italy to your kitchen. First things first, gather all the necessary ingredients. Our authentic pizza recipe calls for a handful of simple yet quality ingredients. Start with the pizza dough, the canvas of our culinary masterpiece. It's the foundation that holds everything together, and it gives the pizza its signature chewy yet crisp texture. Next up, tomato sauce. This is where the tangy flavor comes from. It balances the richness of the cheese and adds a vibrant red color that is unmistakably pizza. Speaking of cheese, grab some mozzarella. Its creamy, melt-in-your-mouth texture and mild flavor make it the perfect cheese for pizza. Don't forget the olive oil. A drizzle of this golden liquid gives the pizza a hint of richness and a beautiful glossy finish. Finally, pick your toppings. This is where you can get creative. From classic pepperoni to exotic pineapple, the choice is all yours. With these ingredients ready, you're all set to start making your pizza. Now roll up your sleeves, it's time to prepare the pizza dough. There's nothing quite like the feeling of kneading fresh dough, and the best part is, it's simpler than you might think. Start by combining warm water with yeast, giving it a gentle stir to mix. Let it sit for about 5 minutes until it becomes foamy. This is an essential step my friends, as it activates the yeast and kickstarts the rising process. Next, in a large bowl, mix together flour and salt. Make a well in the middle and slowly pour in the yeast mixture. Mix it all together until it forms a dough. Now comes the fun part, kneading. Fold, push, turn, and repeat. This isn't just a stress reliever, it's also crucial for developing the gluten that gives our crust that perfect chewiness. Once your dough is smooth and elastic, shape it into a ball, cover it, and let it rise until it doubles in size. Great job! You're one step closer to your homemade pizza. With your dough ready, it's time to get creative with toppings. Now the beauty of pizza is that you can truly make it your own. Traditional toppings are a great place to start. Picture this, a generous layer of rich tomato sauce, followed by a blanket of creamy mozzarella cheese. You can't go wrong with the classics, but why not mix things up a bit? How about a white pizza with a garlic cream sauce dotted with fresh spinach mushrooms and tangy feta cheese? Or maybe a barbecue chicken pizza with a sweet and smoky barbecue sauce base topped with grilled chicken, red onions and a sprinkle of fresh cilantro. And let's not forget about the veggie lovers out there. A rainbow of bell peppers, onions, olives and tomatoes can make a pizza both beautiful and delicious. Remember the key is to balance your flavors and textures. Looks delicious, doesn't it? But hold your horses, we're not done yet. The final step is to bake your masterpiece. The secret to a perfect pizza lies in this crucial step. Preheat your oven to a scorching 475 degrees Fahrenheit or 245 degrees Celsius. This high temperature is what gives your pizza that crispy golden crust we all love. The time has come to slide your pizza onto the middle rack of your oven. Let it bake for about 10 to 12 minutes. Keep an eye on it though. You're looking for a golden brown crust and bubbling, perfectly melted cheese. Every oven is different, so don't be afraid to adjust the baking time slightly. If you like a softer crust, bake it for a little less time. If you prefer a crunchier crust, let it bake a bit longer. And there you have it, a delicious, authentic pizza right from your own kitchen. Buon appetito!